Hi, this is Iksa, and today I want to provide you with some tips on how to navigate through the grocery store. Number one, come prepared. Bring your shopping list, and that shopping list should include all the foods that you're going to need to complete your meal prep for the week, as well as your kitchen staples. Remember, coming prepared will not only help you stick to your budget, but it will also help you stick to those healthier food choices. Number two, shop the outside perimeter of the store first. That's where you will find your fresh fruits and vegetables, fresh proteins, dairy, and whole grains from the bakery. Number three, frozen fruits and vegetables are just as healthy as a fresh variety. And if you're someone who doesn't tend to go through them fast enough and they spoil, sh shopping for frozen fruits and vegetables are a great option for you and they're just as nutritious. Canned foods can also be healthy. You just wanna make sure that you're reading the labels and you're looking for those canned vegetables and those canned beans that say low sodium or no sodium. And for canned fruit, you wanna look for the lower sugar options, which will read in its own juice or in water. When you're navigating through the bread aisle, you wanna look for a whole grain option where the ingredient, the first ingredient on the ingredient list says whole grains, and that's just gonna ensure that you get the most fiber. When you're comparing two foods, you wanna turn around, you wanna read the nutrition label, and you wanna look for the options that are lower in saturated fat, lower in sugar, and lower in sodium. Remember, you don't wanna to come to the store when you're hungry. That's when we start making poor decisions and we tend to find foods or buy foods that we never would have purchased in the first place. And finally, when you're buying those snacks, don't feel guilty about wanting to indulge every once in a while. It's okay, it's called balance. Just make sure that you're reading your food labels, you're looking at the serving size, and that you're portioning out your food when you get home to just that serving size so that you don't overindulge, go overboard, increase your calories, increase your sugar, increase your sodium, and then it gets you off track. If you have any questions, please feel free to message us here. Again, thank you so much and until next time.